Ryan here from shocktillyoudrop.com back once again to highlight one of my favorite movie moments in horror. In this episode, I'm packing my camping gear and heading into the woods for the 1979 film Prophecy. Directed by John Frankenheimer and written by The Omen's David Seltzer, Prophecy, not to be confused with 1995's The Prophecy, is an eco-horror movie that collides with the nature run amok subgenre. Robert Foxworth plays an EPA official who is assigned to fly to Maine and to get into the middle of a spat between a local logging company and the American Indian tribe that lives in the area. Turns out the logging company's chemical waste is doing severe damage to the land. The locals are getting sick and the wildlife is going bonkers. Things kick up a notch when a giant mutated bear shows up to kill this film's cast. Now, mutant mama bear has a good reason to be mad. Her cub has been stolen. She may be deformed, but she still has a mother's instincts. Now the scene that I love in this movie involves an attack on a camp. We find the Nelson family sleeping restfully in the woods, but they're in for a rude awakening when Mutant Mama Bear shows up. This scene is filled with some glorious man in suit action, courtesy of Tom Berman and his effects team. But check out what happens when the little Nelson boy tries to flee while still wrapped up in his sleeping bag. Talk about one of the best kills in the history of horror. Also, best sleeping bag death until Jason Voorhees came along to give us something else to cheer about. Here's a fun fact. Director John Frankenheimer hired ballet dancers and mimes to get into that giant bear suit to give it a different effect than what you might get with a creature performer. So what do you guys think of the prophecy? What's your favorite scene? Use the comment boards here to weigh in, and I'll see you guys next time.